welcome back to my channel midwife life this week's video is going to be a weekly vlog i absolutely love to film these they're not very interesting at all but i really enjoy filming my life and yeah so i hope you enjoy so yeah that's the plan for today okay so i've got some safe medicate modules to do um i need to pick a topic for this presentation that's due in a couple of weeks i haven't even picked a topic yet um i need to make sure i've done all my work for my lecture tomorrow um, change my sheets which I've already done so I can tick that off and I need to check the timetable for this week because we've not been sent any like Microsoft Teams invites yet so I need to check what days I've got and now I've got tomorrow and I was supposed to have Thursday but Thursday's been cancelled or moved to tomorrow as well like we're doing two and one tomorrow but yeah I'm gonna go eat some breakfast so yeah, I've just been watching um, Vampire Diaries. Um, it's leaving Netflix at the start of November, so I've been binge watching it again before it leaves. Um, but now I'm going through my list and I'm gonna sit and do some safe medicate. Um, we're only allowed to do one a day, so if I get that then that's done for today. And then we have to do five. So yeah, I'm gonna sit and do that. <laughs> safe medicate for today yay i passed i need to film a youtube video today actually i do need to do that i might sit and do that now it's pretty cold outside i need to figure out some sort of better lighting um i've just filmed a youtube video should have already been up um it's going up what's today sunday monday tuesday Wednesday, in a couple of days okay so i've checked the timetable sorted my week out so lovely jubbly um now i'm gonna get my textbook out because i can't go on the internet for a couple of hours because i don't really know if they're doing something i don't know whether they've turned it off or i don't really know what they're doing um but i am going to go through my textbook and try and pick a topic that i want to do a seminar presentation on so yes i have a few books um, this is the one that I'm using, so we've just started a module called Introduction to Medicine and Surgery. Um, so this is all like medical disorders in pregnancy. Um, it's the Robson and Woe one, um, which I heard good things about. Um, so I've got that for this, and this is the book that I'm going to go through to try and pick my topic. It's raining, horribly, horribly raining. But we're gonna go. Oh, I'll show you the chickens. Oh, there's the chickens. Oh, they're so cute. Look at that scrawny one there. Bless them. So, I obviously made it home. Um, it's now about seven o'clock. Um, I've had tea. I'm just about to take my makeup off because most of it's worn off anyway. I just look a stay. I look like I'm ready for bed. I'm gonna watch an episode of The Vampire Diaries. I've brought my iPad and laptop downstairs with me so I can get a little bit of work done. Um, but I think I'm just gonna watch Vampire Diaries, maybe a couple of episodes, and then probably put a film on that I've seen before so I can do a bit of work. finished my lecture um it's now half past 10 <laughs> she's done a narrated powerpoint for us to work through at our own pace because um every year rcm royal college of midwives do a conference um and obviously this year it's all online it's all virtual uh, so she's given us a chance to kind of go and watch some of the sessions that they're doing so i'm watching one at the moment that's on COVID. Um, I've literally just tuned in, so I've no idea what they're saying at the moment. But um, yeah, that's what I'm doing today. So that's pretty much all I'm going to be doing. So I'll pick you up if something interesting happens. <laughs> I 
little unboxing for you. So I've got two packages from Amazon here. Um, I ordered them yesterday. Oh, I didn't bring them on. And it's basically, we're not really allowed to have nails um, during like the course that I'm doing at uni. Um, and because I'm still going into placement, um, still going into placement every so often, I thought we'll buy some stick on ones because I'd love to get my nails done properly, but they last a lot longer than obviously stick on ones, so if I want to take them off quickly, then I can. Oh, <laughs> that's the glue that I've got for them. Are the nails, I believe. <gasps> Pretty. <laughs> Look at them. Oh, I got grey, so we're going to put them on right now. Don't mind, this is not on properly, but I'm feeling lazy and it's coming off in a minute anyway, so. But while this is, I think I've got like 10 minutes left, I've got a big pile of laundry there that needs to be put away. Um, I've got to pick out an outfit for tomorrow because I've got to get up early and it just saves time. What else have I got to do? I've got other bits and pieces to do as well, but I've just had a full on pamper night. Pam well, pamper day to be fair, pamper day, I had a shower, washed my hair this morning, I stuck my nails on because these came in the mail, and then I've just done a full pamper skincare thing. This atrocious angle. Let's, let's see if I can get rid of the sun a bit. Um, I'm at the bottom of my drive. You can't actually see my hair, but yes, I did get it dyed. And I'm not sure how I feel about it. I'll try and show you a bit better when I get up to the top. I'm sat at the bottom of the drive so that I can show you. What was going on with this? Is that better? That's just worse. Um, I haven't filmed all that much today. Basically, I drove to Shrewsbury this morning and got my hair done, and it took four hours. And then I had a bit of lunch, a spot of lunch with my friend, and then I've just driven back. So it's now 10 past 5. Um, but I'm just about to go up the drive and I'm a bit scared because they're either going to tell me off for going to a hair salon. But they were really, really good there. Like, they had masks, visors, like eyewear. They were wearing aprons. I had my mask on. There was only two of us in at a time and we were, like, social distanced. So it was, like, as safe as it could be. I don't know how well you can see it or how well the camera picks it up. And to be honest, it looks way better in person, I'm not going to lie. But it's just, I got some like blonde balayage um, and it's like, yeah, I'll try and get a shot of the back at some point but it's a lot blonder than I thought it was going to be. <sighs> Ignore the fact that I've just taken off my makeup but this is kind of a bit of a better, like with the light coming through. Yay, it's Friday and I am so excited that it is finally Friday. I'm absolutely starving. Um, I got home last night from obviously getting my hair done and being in Shrewsbury and everything. And I just went to bed. I got into bed, my electric blanket was on and I was just all cosy. I started watching a bit of telly and I fell asleep. <laughs> and... Yeah, it wasn't the best sleep last night, but I woke up. Um, I didn't have tea last night, which is really bad. You shouldn't skip meals. And then um, I had my lecture this morning. I did not want to get out of bed. So I got out of bed at like 10 minutes before my lecture. I had a um, quick moment to get myself a hot chocolate because I cannot function with that, out that. But I didn't have time to make breakfast. So I haven't had anything to eat since lunchtime yesterday. So I'm going to go get some lunch. It's now half past 12. Um, like I said, I've just finished my lecture. 
my lecture. Um, yeah, now I'm gonna go get some food. Good morning guys. It is Saturday. I'm just about to have a shower. Um, but I just got a package in from Amazon. I got um, some purple shampoo and conditioner because obviously I dyed my hair blonde or I had it dyed blonde. And the hairdresser obviously then said, um, should use purple shampoo and conditioner. I got the Touch of Silver Provoke Strengthening Purple Shampoo and then the matching conditioner as well. So I'm gonna go have a shower and wash my hair with it. So just filmed a video for my mum um, of the whole like, house. Um, the plan now is I really need to sort the living room downstairs out. What else is on my list? Let's have a look. Um, so I've done that. So yeah, I've got some lecture notes to do, but then I'm also a bit behind on some things that I need to do here. So I think I'm gonna go sort the living room out and set up my printer. Um, and then I can tick that off though. Tell you what, having nails, I can't do everything. There you go. See, I think that's what I'm gonna do. Oh, I can't get over my hair. I'm like really terrified that it's gonna like, disappear. Um, like I washed it today with purple shampoo, but now I'm now it's dry. I'm thinking it doesn't look as blonde as it did yesterday. And I don't know whether that's because I'm used, like I'm getting used to it, or like originally it was like a bit of a shock. It was like, whoa, it's blonde. Um. But today, I don't know. As you can see, I am back at home. I'm with my mum. I drove down, what is today? Today's Monday. I drove down yesterday. It was kind of a spur of the moment. I was feeling a bit down in the dumps and I thought, right, we're just gonna drive home. But of course, I forgot to end the video. So this is me ending it. Update, absolutely love my hair. Look, oh, I love it. And I, th I keep thinking it's less blonde. And I think it is because basically I've been doing research, me doing me. I didn't do research before actually, you know, getting my hair done and everything. Um, I just saw a picture and thought, I want that, here you go. But yeah, now I've done research, it said you shouldn't wash your hair for a good 72 hours after getting your hair coloured. Well, I did it 48 hours, so I was a day early. Um, which is probably why, to me, it does look a little less blonde. But it's fine. Um, she said, come back in a few weeks, get it like retoned and topped up and everything. So I'll go back in a few weeks and basically just get it topped up and it'll go a bit lighter but i'm absolutely in love with it because i know um so if you enjoyed this video be sure to give it a thumbs up i love filming weekly vlogs like they're not interesting and my camera skills and editing skills and everything are absolutely awful but i love filming them and yeah i'm gonna try and upload them more often so yes if you enjoyed it be sure to give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you are new and i will see you guys in my next video bye